Well, every Tuesday we catch up with our friend Dr. Lori to play dumpster or no dumpster. But first, as we say hi to Dr. Lori, we want to give her an opportunity to speak on the life and legacy of a very important figure in American art. Dr. Lori. Faith Ringgold, a champion of American art, passed away at 93. She's a New Jersey artist. And she not only supported other artists, women artists, and also African-American artists and other artists of color, she also supported young art historians who wanted to do scholarship in those particular areas of American art. We lost a champion. Some of her works are on my table today. And I hope you'll have an opportunity to either go online or go to a major museum and see some of her work. We'll miss her. A true loss, Dr. Lori, but what a legacy to leave behind. That's for sure. Okay, as we move into dumpster or no dumpster, Dr. Lori, let's explain the rules. So in case you don't know how it works, you send us a photo each week of an item in your home you think might be worth some money. And then of course, we're gonna talk about it. And we're gonna find out if you're right. If the item is worth $50 or more, we keep it. If it is not worth 50 bucks, we throw it into the dumpster. So let's get right to our first item this morning. It's a pin. Yeah, it's a bone pin, actually. It's carved of bone. In the early 1900s, a lot of these pins were carved of bone, utilizing natural materials in order to make jewelry. Uh, this piece dates from about 1925 in the form of a swan. Hmm, this is pretty, Dr. Lori. I'm going to say yeah. no dumpster. No dumpster at $75. Very good. All right, like it. Let's get to our next item this morning, an oil lamp. This is a 1970s oil lamp that has been painted to look like stained glass. It's a miniature oil lamp. It's about five inches tall. It's in working condition. The viewer who sent it into the Facebook page at PHL 17 says it still works. Hmm. I feel like I saw so many of these at my grandmother's <laughs> at one point. Um, let, you said it's painted to look like stainless steel. Mm, let's go dumpster. Painted to look like stained glass, oh, and stained. There it's we go. a dumpster. $15. Yes. Okay. Oh, $15. That's actually less than what I was expecting, but still under the, the $50 <laughs> mark there. And lastly, this morning, we have a purse. How about a box purse from the 1960s? It, it's called a box purse because it really looked like a box. Um, this one, of course, is covered in black material. Uh, black in terms of its color with some gold accents, dates to the 1950s. This would be for the Jackie Kennedy set, the ladies who lunch. <laughs> that looks very boxy for lack of a better word. I know it's a box yeah. purse, but it looks like it would be, yeah. you know, hard to carry around with you. Um, but fashionable nonetheless, let's say no dumpster. No dumpster, 60 bucks. Okay, three for three, Dr. Lori. I'm proud of myself. You should be proud of yourself. <laughs> and if you want to send in a picture so I can appraise one of your treasures around the house, it's PHL 17's Facebook page. We'd love to have you participate in Dumpster or No Dumpster. And Dr. Lori, if people want more information about you, where can they find that? Oh, drlorivee.com. All right, always love playing with you every week, and we will see you again next Tuesday. Thanks so much.